Hey Virgo, welcome back to the channel. Kelly from House of Virgo. Please smash that like button, subscribe if you enjoy the readings. Personal reading link in the description box below. All right, let's get into your reading, Virgo. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Some of the messages may or may not resonate. Take my fits, leave the rest. Okay, we will be together again. There's someone here that really, really believes. They're pretty confident that you and they are going to talk again. You're going to be together again. You're going to reunite. You're going to see each other, get back into a relationship. Let's take a look here. Now, very, con yeah. So you got somebody here like stays awake thinking about you are Virgo on this person's mind like nobody's business. They cannot even sleep. They will purposely, yes, yeah, stay awake. Their show's over. They click off the TV, watching whatever shows they're watching, or they see something in a movie or a TV show that reminds them of you, and then they're triggered. And this person, they shut off their TV. They lay in bed. I see them laying in bed, and they're just thinking about you and everything about you, your smile, the way you talk, the way you kiss. Somebody here is definitely missing you. Look, see, I look for you everywhere. Virgo, this person, everywhere you, everywhere they go, they're hoping to catch you. They're hoping to catch and see you, okay? So even like in out, outdoors, <laughs> the coffee shop that you go to, they still go to, the place, the certain stores you that you still go to, they will show up there just trying to catch a glimpse of you. Even they come to your work, they're just constantly looking for you. Okay, all right, so this could be a friendship as well, but I feel like this person, they may have tried to, I feel like, replace you or uh, maybe replace your friendship or just, I feel like this person's like crazy obsessed with you. They definitely want to be want something to be more if you guys aren't talking or if somebody moved away here okay this person my life is not together as it seems okay so uh, the biggest message i'm getting is i feel like this person may have tried to replace you and they failed they may have had somebody else that they were talking to communicating with um, if it, you guys like broke up or something ended, they tried to replace you by finding another person who looked exactly like you or acted like you. Maybe not like, it could be a doppelganger, but just very, a lot of similarities. And I feel like because you guys couldn't be together for whatever reason, this person went out of their way to try to find somebody else like you to fill that void to fill this void okay yeah so there was some kind of blocking energy um they could not decide so i feel like they honestly like their intuition knows that you are the one for them a hundred percent they know it they're seeing that now the person that they ran to could be somebody that they work with the person that they ran to they just kind of like took a step back and they're like wait a minute no 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 this is not this is not virgo no so i feel like i feel like this person they made it some kind of decision because they thought they would be happy with somebody else but i feel like they might have run away perhaps from the relationship they're like they kind of live in this it feels like a bubble like they tr they run away they try to figure out like okay let me just put on this mask or let me just prov let me just show somebody else that my life is together and then i have maybe i feel like you might have seen that this person was pretending to be something that they weren't and you might have called them out on it and they're kicking themselves now virgo they're kicking themselves right because they tried to go with somebody else try to maybe dupe them and try to get somebody else to believe what they were trying to sell and with the death card no that's over that ended this person's like oh my god now they're back to being in this position here where all they think about is you they're like want to be with you again they can't, they're just constantly obsessed thinking about you here virgo look i mean this person is so they're 
like very physically wild about you okay very much they are so attracted to you everything about you and the other person it was like a 2.0 or 3.0 just didn't have everything it was just not you and this is what now they're realizing i feel like the other person that they were connecting with kind of saw through the bs so i feel like they are kind of like oh they're fooling themselves they're just fooling themselves thinking that they can just run around with this mask on right but apart from all that like you are a wish come true for them and they know it and they're seeing it here they're realizing they're having some kind of an awakening to all of this they've been alone and all they think about is you and it feels like yes the physical you transformed them in some way virgo either by your physical touch or the way you were with them um, the way you even kissed or just the, the the conversations that you had this person is just you're on their mind there's the hermit and they are they're lost they're like it's like i feel like they're by themselves i don't feel like this person is with anybody i feel like they're all alone here so you've got the fool this person sitting here with the fool okay you know what i feel like they're reflecting back about how they made a fool of themselves they they were careless with you they should have been more careful they should have cherished more there's a little bit of regret happening here as well they're reflecting back on how they pushed you away and they were very defensive with you okay very defensive kind of being trying to be somebody who was like really tough really strong very avoidant nothing bothers them they're not affected you know just putting up some kind of a front it feels like flexing like they're flexing trying to be play it cool like they were trying to be like you can't touch me i don't I'm not gonna get hurt but that's not the case <laughs> that's not the case at all I feel like this person was trying to protect themselves um, because they protecting against competition because this person they viewed you or they currently are viewing you as someone who has many options it's like you can it's almost intimidating the amount of people that they believe are interested in you it's almost like intimidating and i feel like this person they just they're kicking themselves for not fighting for the relationship and being defensive let's see okay yeah for breadcrumbing i feel like this person just they doled out a little bit to you just to try to hmm, because there's a lot of insecurity they played this game with you and then they tried to replace you when you caught on to the game or when you faced them and you were like no it's not gonna happen and i feel like they went to somebody else and they were breadcrumbing them and just kind of treating them the way they were treating you because they just figured they could get away with doing that but the fact of the matter is that they couldn't and here they are laying in bed at night just thinking about you all you Yep, I feel like this person, Virgo, this person is going to come in for sure. See this? See the one in the red here who's just kind of in a higher position? <sighs> now they're going to be down here just kind of like, whatever you want me to do, I will do. Whatever you need to do. Yep, there you go. Look at that. <sighs> this person is so incredibly attracted to you it's not even funny like they have a very the physical oh my god so they're definitely going to be coming in virgo to try to make some kind of romantic offer to you they are so in love with you they are so sweet on you i feel like it's mostly because you are the original you're the one that stood up to them or just kind of like put them in their place and said you weren't dealing with any kind of bs they found that more and more attractive 
right? But at the same time, it was like a hit to the ego because they were so defensive. And it's like, oh, you're not going to tell me what to do. And they go and try to find somebody else. But I feel like whoever they've tried to find, even even if that person stood up to them to some degree, or they just kept trying to replace you, nobody rouse, like, ar- like aroused them as much as you did because you are the most important one. You know, you, you are like the number one. So the person that they tried to replace you with might have just put up with their BS for a little bit, called them out on a few things, but there wasn't a challenge. You have something about you that is, is very challenging that kind of turns them on in a lot of ways you know like it's it's like I kind of feel like you I don't know if you said something or you did something but they are completely turned on by the challenge look at these two aces yeah so I mean this part you are like gold to them so they're definitely going to be reaching out to you Virgo like keep that in the back of your head right and only because there's no one compares no one compares to you and they know it and they know it now they know it now virgo so you mm -mm -mm. let me see what is it about you let me see what else okay look at that the knight of swords so you are very assertive and you are not you're, you're fearless you're not afraid to be who you are they love that about you you got that boss kind of attitude with the emperor but you're also like this quiet commanding thing about you you know i feel like they look at you and they're like oh my god it's almost like they they, they like how you i want to say you like you you stand up for yourself like you're quick-witted like you your return is pretty quick you show up in like a very boss mode and then you're like out like you say what's on your mind and then you're out you don't sit and whine you don't sit and like drag it out and try to like get into some, you're just like boom one pop <laughs> and they they like you you know you bullseye it when you have something to say what's on your mind and they're actually really attracted to that because you they you come across as like someone who's a fighter you know, or just stands up for yourself. So I feel like whoever else they were trying to replace you with, like super passive, might have said a few things to them, like, you know, you do this, you do, but more whiny. Whoever they were with, could have been a Pisces, just kind of like passive, waiting for them, no challenge, there's no spark to that relationship the person they were connecting with they tried to replace you with got really really clingy and possessive lacking independence and these are all the things that you have all these qualities that they absolutely you know like they love about you they're kicking themselves now oh yeah you got a king of wands here so this could be a fire sign that you are dealing with and the fire sign is always someone who's really super feisty and confident self-assured you definitely match their energy you definitely were not like a doormat to this person and i don't know something must have happened and now they are they're reflecting and they're thinking back and they're like oh my god i need to get virgo back i need to get virgo back virgo is the one for me could also have been dealing with a king of cups cancer scorpio pisces yep there's going to be like an apology or they're going to come in with something sweet you're being watched the person's like watching you whoever your person is everywhere you go everything you do what you say who you're talking to okay let me see what else the energy is yeah okay so this person obviously walked out because i don't know you must have called them out on something i feel like you called them out or you said something that they were acting like a child or you weren't dealing with this um immature behavior or whatever it was or this pretending that they had it all together i feel like you just saw through the bs they were pretending that they had their shit together they were acting like all you know alpha type of energy like just fronting and you called it <laughs> you called them out on it okay yeah this person's waiting for you oh yeah you are it yep they wish they could <laughs> take back the words and the things that they said or what they tried to like convince you to believe was just a facade 
It's just a facade. They were hiding. They were protecting themselves. There you go. I hid who I really am from you. Yep. Just there was a lot of intimidation, I see. So now they're going to, like, they're not going to be able to resist com coming back into your life and reaching out to you and making some kind of telling you, confessing their feelings. They realize here, Virgo, that they could not replace you. They may have tried. They were running away, you know, because they didn't want to face themselves. So they figure they run and try to find somebody else to fill the shoes. But nobody can fill your shoes, Virgo. Come on, you know that. And whoever they were connecting with was just like, at that, like couldn't even reach your level of awesomeness <laughs> of who you are, Virgo. You make this person want to become a better person. And they hate that, but it's true. But it's absolutely true. Because when you love someone, right, that's what you do. You, especially Virgo. Virgo just always wants people to thrive, right? And whatever issues you guys had, calling them out on something, or whatever you just said to the person in the past, they tried to run away, like I said, and try to connect with somebody else so they don't have to face themselves, but that's not... They miss you. They miss, they miss the, what's the word? The, the realness. They miss the realness. Nobody's as real. So, who, you know, you are just completely unreplaceable. Let me get a couple of charms and see. All right. Oh, okay. We have the Jewish star. That's a one, a six pointed star. Somebody can be from Israel or practice Judaism. Okay, we have a, I'm seeing a, okay, a leaf in water. There's like maybe a pool that's got leaves in it or a pond or you're, maybe you're seeing that, leaves in water. We also have a white carrot. So you might be eating like, a, <laughs> is there such a thing as a white carrot? Yeah. And we have a fairy. Okay, connection to fairies, sunflowers, and there's a rose. Yep. There's a rose. Somebody's name might be Rose. Somebody's name might be Angel. Somebody's definitely this person. Whoever they ran to. One person, two people bumping like a pinball off the bumpers. Coming back to you. Because no, nobody, nothing, nothing compares to you. Okay, Sinead? Nothing compares. Yep, you're it for them. So... Hope you enjoy that. Keep that. Remember, Virgo, you're it. All right. I'll see you guys soon. Bye. My heart rages around like an ocean in my head because there are so many things that I left on.